So here we have the coconut shaves with the peppers. It's got some onions and then we have the egg. And it's super spicy. Oh, we're gonna eat it just like that. Look at the mix here. They're saying it's really spicy. Let's see. Not crazy spicy. Hello everyone, this is David Hoffman from David's Been Here, coming at you from Paramaribo, Suriname, South America. Tonight I'm very excited because I'm gonna be diving into so many different types of foods. We're starting here at Jakarta restaurant. If you guys didn't know, back in like, I think the 50s and 60s, people from the island of Java in Indonesia moved over here. There's one of the best Indonesian restaurants in the city. And after this, we're gonna go see some Brazilian dancing and eat some delicious street food. I'm so excited. You guys pumped? Let's go inside and eat some Indo food. So here we are in the VIP section at Jakarta restaurant. So there's two spaces in the restaurant. When you walk in, you walk up, it's a huge dining hall. There's like really, really long tables. A lot of people there right now. So we decided to come to the VIP section. And the way tonight works is there's buffet, right? So it's Indonesian buffet. There's seven or eight different things to choose from. I think I'm gonna try everything. But before that, we're gonna start with a soup. And we're starting with this. This is the rose milk with coconut. Wow, that's so refreshing. <laughs> it is so hot outside, I can understand why they drink this. Mmm, delicious Indonesian drink. Wow, the coconut with the rose milk, I've never had a combination before. So different, right? Okay, so we're starting off with two soups. This one is the salto soup. It looks delicious, had it earlier today in Suposo. And here we have basically the same thing, but with a big shrimp inside. Huge shrimp. I think I'm gonna go with this one first and just get the shrimp. Look at that ginormous shrimp. Wow. Oh, before that, I wanna show you this drink. Uh, what's this one called? Panda. Panda. Oh, wow. Dude, it's like condensed milk with some, like, uh, what, what herb is that? Is it fruit? It's similar to the rose milk, but with a green taste. So let me start off with the shrimp. I have to. Mmm, humongous jumbo shrimp. And after that, go in here and get some of this. The salto soup is basically tofu with sprouts. And here we also have two sauces. We have like a chili sauce, really spicy, and here we have like a soy sauce. We had one of these earlier, it's a little thicker. I like this one though, it's very yummy. Let's put it in here. Get a big amount, wow, right there. Mmm. Soy sauce is a little spicy, a little dense. <clears throat> oh wow, I mean a little hard that one. Love it, basically fried tofu. So this salto soup, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some spice, some real spice right there, boom. Boom. These are like cayenne chilies. The egg is amazing. Here we go. Nice creamy egg. Oh, and this one's like, like stacked up. Look at this, oh it's tofu, sprouts. Hitting me hard right now. Mm. Oh yeah, it's great. We're gonna start here at the buffet. Got a plate, love the leaf, banana leaf. Perfect. So what do we have, everything? We have the uh, rice and then the coconut milk. Okay, Amazing. We have tofu with rice with uh, 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 chicken. I'll try that then, I'll start with that. This is... So beef with potato and curry, okay. Mm -hmm. Chicken? Chicken. This is uh, mingulu chicken. Mingulu chicken. Yes. So it's like it's like small noodles, thin noodles with chicken. Exactly. Perfect. <laughs> this satay, you know this. Yeah, right? I love satay. Oh, every this day. This is uh, coconut uh, bamboo shoot in coconut milk. Oh, that's gonna be amazing. Bamboo shoot with coconut milk. And then we have eggs with the coconut. It's, right. It's very spicy. Very not, spi not too spicy. A little bit spicy. Let's see. Better. With uh, our uh, vegetable. Okay. Wow, guys, this is like a huge Indonesian feast. Look at how many things I have. I have the uh, chicken satay, I have chicken, I have beef, I have beef with uh, spicy coconut, we have fish, we have more beef, we have the, the bamboo shoot, egg, more spice. <laughs> Everything spicy. Everything spicy. I'm gonna have to start with the satay because I love satay. Look at this. So, this is chicken satay. Basically, chicken on a skewer barbecue. This is very Indo and Thai. Mm. Oh my god. 
Mm, this chicken is so tender, so juicy. The sauce. Mm. Oh, I wasn't gonna eat it all, but so my friend here is telling me to get some of the soy. Just put it on top. Bro, right there. Mm. Mm. When I'm in Thailand, I can eat like 20 of these in a row. Mmm. Mmm. It is so good. It's a little different from Thai. And I gotta tell you, the staff here is amazing. Everybody's super nice. Super, super nice. So we're gonna try some of the beef with, what is this, coconut? Oh wow. It wasn't kidding. It's spicy. It's like grains of coconut that have been like a little roasted. Then you have super tender beef. Wow. Dude, this is so yummy. I'm gonna jump over here to have some chicken. Some random chicken here. Mmm. Mmm. I love the way they're cooking the poultry. Everything's super tender. And the sauces, I mean, it really makes a difference. Oh, and then here we have bamboo shoots. Mmm. So I was thinking everything's gonna be really spicy. Not so spicy. No, not, not gonna kill me, you know? You have the white sticky rice in the bottom. This food is like phenomenal. Like, oh, I love the ride here. Wow. Man, what delicious sticky rice. Unreal. Next time I get some more of the beef, it's like straight beef. Mmm, the beef curry. Just the right toughness, almost like jerky. Spicy samba, so you have like kidney here. Mmm, mmm. Oh wow, samba's delicious. It's spicy. It's um, it's fruity. Mmm. I don't even taste pieces of the chicken because they're all diced up together. Mmm. The samba. Samba, that's okay. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. And then here we have the lo mein with the chicken, right? <laughs> mm hmm. So here we have the coconut. Shaves with the peppers, it's got some onions, and then we have the egg. It's super spicy. Oh, we're gonna eat it just like that. Look at the mix here. They're saying it's really spicy. Let's see. Mm. Not crazy spice. Have some more. Coconut shavings with some spice. With some nice, uh, like greens, like green beans, but not green beans, a little different. With the egg. So there's the fish, and she's saying there's no bones. Do I believe that? Mm hmm. Oh, bones. So there are some bones. You gotta break it apart slowly. Mm hmm. You gotta try this with the soy. You have to try with the soy. Right there. Mm hmm. Mm. Everything was good with that soy sauce. It's like glazy soy sauce and the spice. Mmm. Let me see. No bone. See the fish. See if you find any bones. You don't. And yeah. I mean, we tried basically everything. I'm just gonna go to town on this. Look at this chicken. Oh, this is great. Nice glaze. Do you know the perfection? I mean, I just love the Asian taste of this food. Mm. I'm gonna get something else that's spicy. Let me see what else I got. I, I feel all the spice right now. <laughs> so this is tofu with rice, right? Yes. Spicy. Tofu? Uh, not too spicy, but it has. Okay, so the next dish we have here is basically tofu with rice. We have some coconut, and then we also have what else is in here? Just tofu, huh? And some sprouts. Lots of sprouts. It's amazing. She basically drowned the entire thing with the soy sauce. Mmm. So fried tofu. Beautiful sprouts. Mmm, very freshly crunching. Mmm, I love the sauce here. The sauce is so unique. Spicy. Yeah, it's, it's something they invented here because I've never tried soy sauce like this, like spicy and a little thick. This is the best dish. Mm. It's like a sweet, spicy tofu veg dish. I can drink the sauce. 
No, no, no. <laughs> the owner wasn't kidding. He really wanted to feed me tonight. So I had all the food at the buffet. I tried like nine things. And now he brought me this like board. There's shrimp, a piece of like a steak right there. And we have some veggies. This one has like a mushroom sauce. And these shrimp just look amazing. They're huge shrimp. And then we also have another dish. It's like a fried rice. It's called picante. And it has shrimp, chicken, and egg. And then a super spicy red sauce inside. Just gonna try everything. I'm not gonna eat too much. I mean, I still have a lot of food to go for later, so, and I already ate a lot. This is a lot of food. I didn't know this was gonna happen. Oh, super tender. I love beef tenderloins with like sauces like this, like mushroom sauces. Look at this sauce. And here we go. Mmm. That's just another bite. <laughs> just one more tiny bite. Mmm. I love the mushroom creamy sauce. Oh, it's just like a medium rare. That's incredible. That is so good. Just gotta take it slow. I'm gonna try some of these right with some broccoli, some well, some cauliflower, and some carrots. Mmm. Oh, wow. Nice spices. Mmm. Very moist. It's an incredible veggie little side. Oh, it's like super moist. And over here we're gonna try shrimp, right? So you gotta take it apart. Take off the shell. Oh, it's a little hard. Not so easy. The bigger the shrimp, the tougher it is to open up. Usually it's very easy. This one's giving me problems. Take off the legs. Mmm. All oh, the shrimp has been cooked like on a barbecue, like on the grill. Oh, so freaking good. And there's so much flesh. So I get in here and take everything off. All three of these are amazing, amazing. And here we have the picante. Wow, so Indonesian fried rice. Here we have a nice hot sauce. Let's get some of that. Mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was like, it's like a glaze, but super spicy. Ooh, look at this. Indonesia has spicy food. Look at that, and I got a lot of that. Last thing I'm gonna try, I'm gonna get some of this rice. Well, yeah, exactly. Get some of the chicken right there, a lot of chicken. Get a little bit of this and try it. Full pork with the rice. It's been cooked on the wok, but this sauce, it's spicy. At the same time, it's very like glazy. The thing is that it gets you the chilies. So the rice dish is phenomenal, but it's just way too much food at this point. I had a lot of that spice. It's hitting me so hard. The cayenne pepper. Don't play with that. That what? Because that sauce was so spicy, it's like I have to have one of these. You know, the rose milk with coconut. At this point, it's really heavy, but this is the only thing that's gonna calm the heat down. It was so hot. So hot. I didn't know Indonesian food was that hot. All right, let's go. Okay, Jakarta restaurant. So much good food. I mean, every single thing we tried was delicious. Gotta say, hands down though, the the tofu with the sauce that was an, a bomb plate, bomb. So good. So now we're gonna see some dances. Yes. Let's go, man. Yeah, we're good. I eat like all the pure samba, and it's like, man, just way too much spice. Imero, okay. yeah, the best tour guide. When you come, you book your tour with Jenny Tours. You get Imero. <laughs> And here we go, we're back in the center of Paramaribo and I can hear the songs, I can hear the dancing. It's like bars, must be like a yeah, casino right there. And he's saying the dancing's over here. I mean, hopefully they started already because it's still really early, it's only 9 p.m. But there's a Brazilian block party. Not many people here yet. It's basically just mad restaurants. Lots of music, but no one's dancing. So here in this little block party on this side of the street, we have like three different vendors. They're selling like Brazilian food. Here we have mingau, which looks like like almost like a macaroni and cheese. And we have some other like it looks like a puré of uh, it's a type of fruit puré, like more like a platano. A lot of good food here. They also have soups, but I'm really full. I, I really don't want to eat any more food. But the crowd is starting to come. You know, it's Saturday, it's 9 p.m. You know, until it's gonna be like another two or three hours before it's full, and then people are dancing in the street. We might not be there in two hours, so I think we're gonna chill for a bit, 
If we get a drink, we find a drink. So basically this is a Brazilian area, right? So there's like three different restaurants here. That side is restaurants slash street food. Over here is a restaurant. There's also a bar inside. And what I'm doing is I'm gonna try some Brazilian beer. It's called Shin. So Shin. I've never tried it before. I've never been to Brazil, so. Oh man. Yeah, it's another like light beer from a country. Not bad though. Refreshing. Right now it's way too cool to have more food, so I'm gonna take it easy. And as you can see, lots of families here. Everybody here is Brazilian. The good thing is that because they're Brazilian, they speak Spanish. A lot of these people are like talking to me in Spanish, so it's easier for me to get around, obviously. But yeah, I mean, lots of families playing around here and running around, people drinking and eating. All right, guys. So that was an epic night. I mean, we started off with some delicious Indonesian food, Jakarta restaurant, Java food, so good, super spicy. My stomach is still aching a little bit because I overdid it with one of the spices there. I don't know why I did that, but the food overall was amazing. Everything was a tofu dish for sure. And then we came over here to this like Brazilian area, a few different restaurants there. They got a bar. They have food, they have street food as well, if you want to try some of the street food there. I mean, personally, I'm just too full, I couldn't do that. But yeah, we just sat down, we got a beer, we relaxed. It was like a, a sort of like a kid party in the middle, the kids were running around. And yeah, I mean, just all Brazilian people there though, it's like crazy. I've never seen a group of that many Brazilians outside of Brazil. Seeing some places in Miami, but not like that, where it's just only Brazilian people who have moved. So guys, I hope you love this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. I'll see you in the next travel food adventure in Suriname, South America. Peace.